Hey everyone! Well, I'm back from vacation, and um, I don't know if you could really consider it a vacation because we only stayed over two nights, and that's not very long. But yeah, it was a vacation. It was like a mini vacation. We had decided instead of going to Las Vegas for um, five nights like we normally do, we would take two mini vacations this year because um, with my back problem, I don't think that I could do a six hour plane ride because um, it just would be too painful, I think. But anyways, um, yeah, we went to Connecticut for two nights and we had a great time and uh, my husband videotaped a lot of the vacation and um, his username on YouTube is 30 lines one bet so if you want to see footage from my vacation you can just go to his channel and um, yeah they don't let you film everywhere uh, one of the places that we went was the Native American Museum at Foxwoods um, it's uh, it's it's not on the property, it's like behind it in a separate building, but oh my god, that was so interesting, and um, they also have a gift shop and a restaurant, and it was really fun, but um, yeah, so they don't let you film there, so we couldn't get any footage from there, but uh, oh yeah, at the Native American Museum, I got this hair clip shaped like a butterfly, and, um, and I got this necklace, and I got these bracelets and then we also went to Old Mystic Village and um, I'll, I'll show you the things that I got there in my video that I do tomorrow um, because I have to get started on this otherwise I'm not going to get through it while we were there we went while we were in Connecticut we went to the um, premium outlets that are about oh I don't know 20 minutes half hour away from where we were staying and I went to the CCO there that's mainly the reason why I wanted to go there I wanted to see if they had different things than what my CCO at home has and um, here's what I got I got the Summer Rose Beauty Powder. Now this, I know that the, uh, I think it was Liber Liberty of London that this just came out with recently, but this is from the Rose Romance Collection, but it's the same thing. And I think um, this one here has got the nice rose imprint on it, which I don't think they did that on the Liberty of London one that just came out. But it's a really nice, um, beauty powder. I'm wearing it as a blush today. And then I got the <clears throat> Hello Kitty beauty powder in Pretty Baby. Looks like that. And this is, um, um, I would say probably a highlight. You could use it as an all-over setting powder, but I think I'm going to use it as a highlight because it's got sort of a, a coralish hue to it. And then I got uh, MAC Pigment in Vanilla. Oh, and by the way, guess what I found out this morning? Um, starting this summer, they're going to have pigments at MAC counters and MAC stores. So you won't have to get these strictly online or at CCO anymore. So that I thought that was nice. Um, I also got a paint pot in green stroke. It looks like this. And <clears throat> this ended up being the perfect base for one of the eyeshadows that I got, which is called One Off. It looks like that. Um, wearing one off as my eyeshadow today and um, so those two things go together nice and that's a star flash finish and uh, funny story well not funny but <laughs> anyways um, after we left the outlets and um, got back on the highway to head back towards where we were staying I was looking at the eyeshadows that I bought and I realized that they were Starflash. Now Starflash is my favorite eyeshadow finish and all I had up until that point was Smoke and Diamonds and um, 
So I'm looking at the eyeshadows and I'm like, oh my god, these are all Starflash. And my husband's like, yeah. I said, well, that's the my favorite eyeshadow finish. So I was really happy about that. But the downside is if I had realized that they had a bunch of Starflash, I probably would have gotten everything they had that was Starflash. Um, just because they are, you know, you can't get them anymore. And... Um, all I had was smoke and diamonds. But anyways, so I got one off, and then I got Talent Pool, which is a beautiful shade of blue. And I got Fashion, which is, um, it's silver that has just a hint of green in it. Really pretty, unusual color. And I got Glamour Check, which is, um, sort of a reddish brown and um well it's reddish brown but it could also be considered like copper that's what it reminds me of a lot too is like the color of a sort of a penny or a brass a copper or a brass color and those all four are um star flash so i did pretty good at the cco i found some really good things and um, tomorrow I'm going to, well, hopefully tomorrow I'm going to do a video and I'm going to show you um, the things that I had sent to my house while I was on vacation because while I was gone, the um, makeup artist collection came out. So I didn't want to miss out on that and we weren't going to be near any MAC counters or MAC stores or anything. So, um, yeah, I had some things from that sent to my house plus I'll show you what I got at Old Mystic Village which is a collection of um, stores that they had in Mystic Connecticut so I'll see you then bye